What is up guys, it's your boy Gun Suck Me Off and welcome to another quick tip. In this quick tip I'm going to show you two different ways of making a beat slow down and yeah that's about it. So I have this beat and then I'll show you the slowdown. So this was the beat, I mean, it's a beat, so it's gonna get repetitive, and here's the slowdown. So let's see how you can achieve this effect. First of all, you need the beat. So, I imported the beat in a new project, just because I don't want to change the original FLP. So, you know, you can do this in your own project. First of all, you gotta select the part that you want to use as your slowdown. I'm just gonna choose the first 4 bars with drums, basically from 5 to 9. And I'm gonna press Ctrl and R to render it as a WAV file. Then I'm gonna go at the end of the beat or in the middle, it depends on where you want to have the slowdown. I'm just gonna pretend that I have no slowdown in this beat, just so I can add it. Then I'm gonna import the rendered file. I'm gonna enable stretching in my timeline. Then I'm gonna stretch it from 4 bars to 8 bars. And this is pretty much it for this method. So let's see how it sounds. I mean, yeah, you can always add some gross beats, you can add a uh, vinyl off at the end just so it just slows down or whatever even more and it ends like that so it won't end just, you know, in a weird way. I mean, yeah, this is pretty much it for the first method, now I'm gonna show you the second method. I'm just gonna cut this here, because uh, the drums don't have the laughing effect, so it's more clean. And I'm gonna paste them twice, so basically I'll have another 8 bars of drums. Then I'm gonna go to the master track, add a gross beat, right click on the right arrow, select momentary, and then half speed. I'm gonna right click on the volume knob in the mixer master tab, like the effects tab, create automation clip. I'm gonna lower the first point, then I'm gonna add another point right where the drums start, the ones that I want to slow down, and I'm gonna add another point and raise this to the max and let's see how it sounds as you can see it you can hear a cut so it depends on what sound you want to achieve that's why i rarely use this method but you can still use this if you feel like this fits to your beat so yeah, you can always add more gross beats and play with the effects, make it more stuttery so the pause from the first bar to the second bar won't be as noticeable. You know what I mean? Basically you can do whatever you want, it's your beat, it's your song, play with it, make sure it sounds good, and that's about it. But I mean yeah, it was your boy Gun, so I'm out. It used to be a house there, now it's just an empty slot. That's weird. Also, hello, what the fuck?